bilingualism or learning more than one language at the same time is not a negative thing. Um, it should be done in the right way. Um, you can definitely expose your child to, to two languages since birth, but very important is to not mix those languages. So if you are speaking English, you are speaking English. You're not throwing in an Afrikaans or a Portuguese or a French word as well. Um, because children need to learn that they are now learning or acquiring two different languages. And so it's very important that they are realize that they are not learning one language which they can mix the English and the Portuguese words. They are just learning one. They are learning two different languages. Um, sometimes we do see that children who, who are raised in a bilingual home, they say their first words slightly later than, than a child who just grow up monolingually. Um, but it does in the long run. It does not um, have any negative influences. And being able to master two languages um, has its benefits um, academically. Um, and it also develops your um, linguistic section in your brain. Um, and going forward, you then find it easier to learn new languages. So bilingualism is not a negative thing if the parents do it right. So what we often recommend is why don't you try a strategy, strategy like one parent, one language? So maybe mommy and I talk English to each other. Daddy and I speak French to each other. So that the child is not confused about, is this word English or is it French? Another strategy is one context, one language. So maybe at school, I speak English. At home, when it's family time, meal time, TV time, I speak Afrikaans. But when I do homework with mommy, I speak English again. So each um, partner or each situation is then connected to a specific language that makes it easier for the child.